G'day guys, Oliver here from Pacific Toyota. Just giving you the virtual tour of our 2016 Mitsubishi Outlander. Now, first off, I'd just like to give you a bit of a run through our showroom here in Cairns. Here at 77 Mulgrave, we are uh, one of two yards, the other being located at 235 Mulgrave Road. But uh, as you can see at, uh, at 77 Mulgrave here, we have a very large variety of stock, ranging from your SUVs, through to your four wheel drives and, uh, and sedans as well. So a very, very large variety of stock. Now, I'd just like to get back to the virtual tour on the vehicle. Now, this is just a detailed run through the car just to show you all the ins and outs of the vehicle and the overall condition. If there is anything that does catch your attention, please don't hesitate to let me know and I'll do my best to rectify the issue. As you can see, all the bonnet here is all in, uh, all in excellent condition, all really clean, really neat and tidy. There's no, uh, no stone chips or anything like that along the bonnet. Now, we'll just run through front of the vehicle here as you can see all in really really good condition like I've said really clean really neat and tidy no uh no stone chips or anything like that on the vehicle which is really good to see there is just a tiny little mark just there and there and as you can see still plenty of tread left on your front passenger side tires so uh there's still still plenty of k's left on them now just run through just got your uh just got your passenger side uh, door here so you can see all the passenger side doors all in excellent condition once again uh, there is just a just a little mark just there but nothing really too major a couple little bits and pieces here and there but um yeah nothing nothing really too much to worry about now as you can see all the uh all your passenger side seats are all in excellent condition all really really good stitching all still really um in, in good good condition all really clean, really neat and tidy. On the uh, on the interior, as you can see, all the interior of your doors are all in really good condition as well. You do just have your speaker just there, uh, just your water bottle holder, electric window liner, and your, your door handle just there as well. And you just got your little tweeters as well, uh, just on your doors there. So all in really good condition on the uh, front passenger side. Now just running through, you just got your back passenger side door. All your back passenger side doors all in really good nick. There is just there is just a couple little marks here and there, uh, but obviously with a, you know, a pre-owned vehicle, you are going to get a couple little marks. Uh, but as as you can see, all the interior of the uh, back seats are all in really really good condition. Uh, once again, really good stitching. There's no um, no burn holes, no cuts or anything like that in the seats. All your floors are in really good condition. All the back of your seats are all in all in really good nick as well. As you can see, all the interior of the uh, of your back uh, passenger side door is all in really good condition as well. Uh, there is just a tiny little mark just there, but you can get that out pretty easily. Uh, you just got your uh, speakers there, just got your water bottle holder there, electric window liner, and your door handle as well. So, as you can see, you do just have your back uh, passenger side tire just there as well. Obviously, still in excellent condition. And we'll just run through to the uh, back of the vehicle here. Yeah, as you can see, you have four parking sensors on the back. So one just there, one there, another one there, and another one just there as well. As you can see, all the, all the back of the, uh, back of the vehicle here is all in really, really good condition. Uh, there is just a thing just missing there. So I'll we'll just open up the boot. Lovely big boot space in the back. And just got your little compartments in here as well, as that can uh, that can lift up. Just put that one back in, and just to the side here, you do have your uh, jack uh, just stored away in there, and just got your uh, your tools there as well. So um, you know, if you if a spare tire, uh, sorry, if a um, tire goes flat or anything like that, you got your spare tire and everything in uh, in the back there. Yeah, I'll just. Underneath, and you just got your spare tire just under there, as you can see. All right, so we'll uh, we'll just keep running through to the driver side. As you can see, all on the driver side here is all in excellent condition. Uh, still plenty of tread left on your on your back pass. Uh, sorry, your back driver side tire, as you can see. Still got the uh, the little bits on the end there. So as you can see, all in really good condition. Just got your back driver side door here as well all in really good condition as well. 
There's just a couple little stone chips here and there. Ah, uh, but as I've said, yeah, it is a pre-owned vehicle, so you are going to get a couple little, couple little marks here and there. As you can see, all your uh, back pass, oh, sorry, yeah, um, all your back passenger seats, all in really good condition. You just got your your cup holder just there as well for your back passengers. So. All your floors in really good condition as well. All your uh, all the back of the driver side seats and everything are all in really really good condition. All the interior of the doors all in really good nick. There is just a, a little mark just there and there, uh, but nothing really too major. You just got your uh, speaker there, water bottle holder there. Uh, just got your electric window wiener and just your door handle as well. And lastly, you do just have your driver side door. As you can see, all the driver side door once again all in really good nick. Really good condition. There is just there is just a couple of little just one mark there, just a, another little mark there and there, uh, but nothing really, nothing really too major on the rest of the vehicle. And lastly, you do just have your uh, front driver side tire, as you can see, still with uh, still with plenty of tread left on those tires. So I'll just jump inside the vehicle and uh, we'll just run through a little bit of the interior and a few of the controls. Just turn the vehicle on. As you can see, all the dash is all in uh, all in excellent condition. So no sun damage or anything like that on the um, on the dash. As you can see, no warning lights or anything like that are coming up. You just got your uh, just got your handbrake and um, uh, seatbelt warning there. But obviously, once you, you you know put those on and take them off, then um, yeah, all the lights are going to go away. All right, as you can see, you just got your controls for your uh, your volume just here as well. Uh, skipping through your, your stations or songs, whether you have your, your Bluetooth set up. And as you can see, you just got your mode button there. So you just got the FM, AM radio, your Bluetooth audio. Just uh, show you the screen there. So you just got your FM, AM radio, and Bluetooth audio there as well. You got your voice recognition. Uh, answering and hanging up your phone calls just there just got all your uh, cruise control settings here as well and you just got your uh, traction control just there and your uh, your parking sensor button just there as well as you can see you got all your uh, got all your electric um, window one is there uh, obviously controls all all rest of the four doors and as you can see you got all your touchscreen display here as well you can uh, yeah, change through all your all your settings there too. Got your eco mode there. Obviously, all your uh, air conditioning settings there. Just got your gear shift just there. Handbrake and just got a uh, 12 volt power outlet just there and the uh, USB port as well. So I'll just run you through a little bit of the service history on the vehicle. All right, so we'll start from the start. As you can see, you've got your uh, 12 month or 15,000 kilometre service done there on the uh, 7th of the 4th, 2017 at 15,469 kilometres. Got your 24 month or 30,000 kilometre service done there on the uh, 3rd of the 9th, 2018 uh, with 29,829 kilometres. You got your 36 month or 40,000, 45,000 kilometre service done there on the 18th of the 4th, 2019. Uh, we're 45,295 kilometres. Got your 48 month or 60,000 kilometre service done there on the 17th of the 3rd, 2020. Uh, we're 60,217 kilometres. Got your 60 month or 75,000 kilometre service done there on the 24th of the 12th, 2020. Uh, we're 72,187 kilometres. And lastly, you just got your 72 month or 90,000 kilometer service done there on the 4th of the 8th, 2021, uh, at 87,710 kilometers uh, done by Coral Motors, which is us. So as you can see, there is uh, 87,741 kilometers on the clock. And your next service is in June till the 8th, 2021, or at 103,000 kilometers, uh, whichever, um, whichever occurs first. So, 
just pop the bonnet and we'll uh, have a bit of a look through look through the engine bay. Alright guys, that is your virtual tour of your 2016 Mitsubishi Outlander. Thank you.